I've come back through that door, I'm still going to be champion of the world. I love you. I was always looking for other things, other films in my head that I want to make, and Journeyman was one that I actually started writing when I was in Glasgow when I was making my short film, Dog All Together, that became Tyrannosaur. I've been a boxing fan since I was a kid, so I always felt drawn to the idea of making a, a boxing film. But if I was gonna make one, I didn't want it to be about those archetypal kind of themes, you know? I wanted it to, to have some different kind of resonance to it, and I didn't want to play those, those kind of, the same notes that a lot of boxing films do. And having been a boxing fan and seen many different boxing tragedies over the years, I just thought, well, if I'm going to tell a boxing story, at least it's about a, di a new kind of territory, you know. Oh, oh. Matty? I mean, it took me a long time to admit that I should play the part, you know, and I, and I looked at other actors, the other po uh, possibilities of other people playing the role, and um, I don't know, and it just occurred to me one day that um, the part was for me, and if somebody else would have come to me with this role, I would have done it. Ready? Get home. I want you. Who is it? That is your little girl. It's Mia. Mia. Do you understand? No. What was interesting about it was on, on Tyrannosaur, you you were very much directing it, um, and. And you're inside those characters, but you've got the eye on the outside of it all. With this, I was in the middle of the experience as the lead character, effectively, you know. There might have been a few things that I missed by not being able to step back. But also, I think there was a lot of great things that came from being inside it. So you just got to, to live with the choices that you made. But it was very interesting creating a film when you're the lead character and you're the one plotting your way through it, you know. Who are you fighting? Future.